Justin Germino from DragonBlogger.com and I'm here showing off the Akison laptop cooling pad. See, one thing I like about this cooling pad is not only does it have two very large fans and two small fans, but it's got a digital display and readout with an on-off button. It's got a rather wide clip that could hold your laptop. You see I have a very thick, large MSI gaming laptop and a lot of times if I put it on a laptop cooling pad, the bottom is so big that it will just come across the clip and fall off. But this one can sit on and hold it on an angle and it holds out just fine. So that's really nice and one of the features I like about it. Very few laptop pads can hold the weight of this 17 inch laptop and not have a problem with this clip. So that's pretty good. Obviously this is the angles. You could adjust it at. It adjusts up or down. It comes with a really short um, USB cable so you do have the option of buying a longer USB cable if you need to it takes up a USB port but it gives you that USB port back the only problem is it is a USB 2 port not a USB 3 port so it can't do any sort of charging and it's not as much power so let's go ahead and turn it on here and then of course you got your nice little blue LEDs let me lay it flat real quick here okay let's lift the pad here there so now we got the cooling pad, you can feel decent airflow. You can see right now the cooler pad's going. You can see it's it's operating. Let's increase the temperature, make it a little faster. Kind of weird that the plus sign's on the left instead of the right, but we'll boost up the speed here. And I can feel more airflow. We'll lower the lights there. Let's get that up there. And there we go. And so you can feel some airflow. You see, the laptop itself, with my temperature read, was reading, let's see here. I did definitely notice a temperature drop. So my laptop was reading around 94. That's not with me playing the games. It's around 94, 95. Easily goes up to about 100 degrees. Um, this cooling pad does a really good job of knocking the heat down when I had the laptop on. Now, when I do the reads from the top of the laptop, it didn't notice as much. When I was doing the reads from the bottom of the laptop and the bottom of the grill, it definitely noticed uh, a little bit of a drop in the temperature. Now, the airflow is pretty good. As long as your laptop has a lot of vents on the bottom, it could basically blow the cool air up into the vents and help disperse that hot air into the laptop. I'd say the pad works out pretty well. It could have been a little bit faster airflow, I think. And of course, this is a 17-inch laptop, right? And so, the laptop is a little larger than the pad by quite a bit so it could have been a little bit larger um, of a pad to fit my 17th laptop but other than that the Acasing laptop cooling pad worked out pretty well and was better than my previous laptop pad that I was using. Thank you.